Carbon dioxide is essential for photosynthesis. Here is a small activity that will demonstrate that carbon dioxide is essential for the process of photosynthesis. Select a potted, healthy plant with long and narrow leaves. Keep it in the dark for two or three days. This will ensure that the leaves are free from starch. Now, take a wide-mouthed glass bottle with a cork to close the mouth of the bottle. Split the cork vertically. On the day of the experiment, take 5 to 10 milliliters of potassium hydroxide solution in the bottle. Potassium hydroxide absorbs the carbon dioxide present in the bottle. Early in the morning, insert one half of a selected leaf into the bottle through the split cork without cutting it from the plant. The other half of the leaf, or the base part, is to be left outside the cork. The bottle is to be kept airtight, which can be achieved by applying grease or Vaseline around the rim of the mouth of the bottle. Make sure that the outside air does not come in contact with the leaf in the bottle. Keep this unit in the sunlight for three to four hours. After three to four hours, detach the leaf from the plant and take it out of the bottle. Test it for starch with iodine solution. We'll observe that the part of the leaf which was inside the bottle does not turn deep blue. However, the part of the leaf that was exposed to the surroundings prepares starch and so turns deep blue. Note that both halves of the leaf receive the same amount of sunlight and water and both have chloroplasts. However, the portion of the leaf that was inside the bottle could not receive carbon dioxide. This proves that green leaves can perform photosynthesis only in the presence of carbon dioxide.